Yo, what's going on YouTube? This is Rage Rambler bringing you another FIFA 20 Ultimate Team Pack opening video. But first, I want to take a look at my squad and make a couple changes. Oh, by the way, today is Tuesday, October 1st at 2.53 p.m. Eastern Time. Real quick, I made a couple changes. I took Delaney out. I, I changed with the 4 2 three, one formation because of my, um, I'm not really getting a lot of attacking options, and when I do get attacking options, I'm, I leave myself wide open. So basically, I want to instruct these two strikers to come back on defense, to stay in the middle of the field, to have Coman and Dem Dembele uh, cutting inside to make their run. So at all times, I'll have five guys around close to, not center center, but a little more narrow. Um, I, sh I will probably switch to a 4 one 2 and 2 2 which means the left mid and right mid become uh, center mids. Probably will do that, but I'm going to give it a shot one game first, see what how I do in squad rivals, online play. So the changes I made, I bought um, a Tweety. Now, I highly recommend you buy him before his price goes up. He is at 36,500 coin. Actually, he's more like 38. I sniped him for 36.5. Um, now, I was comparing both cards, and they're both very similar. Delaney is better, and he is also a new form, which means he's not in, no longer in packs, but he's around 70k, and Matuidi's only 35, and he links up much better than Delaney. I can't link with anyone, really, except for Theo Hernandez, and I got Linglet out of a two-player, um, untradeable, two-player, two-goal player rare pack, or whatever you want to call it. I can't remember the exact name, but basically the gold upgrade pack. The first one I ever did, I pulled Linglet, and he's at 80k right now, so I have to play him. And he's also very, very good. So it saves me some coins of buying somebody else, like a Varane or a Ramos. Um, those two are probably the only other two I would really buy, other than uh, I like Nesta, like 89 or 90 Nesta, like 300k. It's actually a really good card comparing, uh, considering. I'm thinking I actually really upgrading to him. I'm thinking about selling Theo Hernandez and getting um, Nesta for literally, he's only like 100k more than Varane, which Varane's a little better though, don't get me wrong, but a little better, but icons link up much better with, obviously they link with anyone. I also bought De Gea. I highly recommend you buy him before weekend league because I know the goalies are having problems with rebound goals. I had 90 for stage in the pool in the pack, sold him for 44k, took the remaining money and coins and bought the hey, who is the best goalkeeper in the game at 70k, is a steal. He'll most likely, after, I would say, I may not even be after this weekend, it literally might be, because 170 is his max, he'll probably hit, he'll most likely double, I should probably buy another one just to hold on to, but I want to save the rest of my coins, I mean, I, I'm not 100% positive yet, I may buy one more um, Matuidi and one more De Gea, also, oh yeah, also about Thurum, I there's no one, absolutely no one you can really buy for because for uh, link up with Lewandowski, unless you're getting a icon player, but for 17, what I pay? 18,000 coins. Durham is a very good option. 86 pace, 80 shots, 75 passing. This is just for now to play a couple games with. Of course, I didn't get a freaking clean, um, fresh one, but it's whatever. I don't really don't care. He links up obviously to, with the, these French players, and he links up with Lewandowski, who now is, if I can get to it, he is now a 10 chem because he got Coman on the left. Coman's starting to play a little better. Two goals, four assists. I know it's not good, but I don't really don't use my left mids um, more than I use my right mids. However, Dem Dembele's not doing great either. He's four goals, four, uh, four assists. I'm not really scoring a lot with the one striker formation. That's why I need to change. Griezmann's got seven goals, two assists. He had ball for 590. He's at 620 now. That was my big, big investment. Hoping he hits a million by next week. So this is basically the best possible formation with the players I have up, uh, especially with Lewandowski and um, Griezmann I can come up with, that can still give me uh, 100 chem, however De Gea is at a 4 chem, there's no, I, unless I get Van Dyke, there's nothing that, or, or Nesta, there's nothing I can do, actually it would probably be Nesta, I'm probably going to do that, I'm probably going to sell Theo Hernandez, the only thing with Theo Hernandez is, dude he's, he's at 70k, and he's basically Varane. I mean, if you look at the, the numbers, he's pretty much Varane. 70, he's at 80k right now. And Varane's over 200. And they both have very similar stats. If you look at it real quick, once I uh, 
remove someone real fast. Oops, yep, I don't know what I'm doing. Send my club. I'm probably going to sell Casemiro. I'm not sure. Alright, so we're going to look at center back. We're going to look at concept players. Probably shouldn't have done that. Yeah, so the Nesta was, is, or is it Nesta that I want or Ken Navarro? No, it was Nesta, 71 pace. 90 rated. He's at 300 something K. I know he's only 71 pace, but it's not horrible. Um, for rain, I can't remember his, I can't remember his rating. I mean, let me go to French real quick. Jesus Christ, if I can fucking get to it, that'd be great. The, the menus are complete opposite, opposite from how it was before. Okay, concept players on. <sighs> My apologies. Whoever did these fil filters and the menu system, whoever created it, came up with it was, was really drunk. Okay, Varane's right here. Um, he has 83 pace. That's a big difference. Now, he's over 200k. Come on, I'm fucking selecting him. Alright, so 83 to 81. Hernandez is better than every other stat but defense. Varane is 200k. Hernandez is 80. I really think that once he hits the... 100k mark, they want to increase his price. He'll probably grow. He could have a chance of going over 100k, but range is range 200. Hernandez is definitely the next best option. He's literally probably the second best you can possibly get for the money. Actually, probably the best you can get for the money. Him and Linglet. Linglet's pretty good too. Eight, but he's at, he's rising 80k. So you got 80k and actually he's more like 75k, 80 and 75, as opposed to 200. So the only way I would get rid of him right now would be if I got an icon and and then I can put anyone at left back um Rusillon or Rusillon whatever he's a good, really good option for me but he's not the best there's a couple others like Mendy um I could use him too but uh then I want to have a link with Kuman so for now that's what I have to go with but but I think my next upgrade change probably is going to be Hernandez because he's close to that 100k mark and he may not get an increase but he might I'm not sure Crabble Hall is just here only because uh, I do like his defense for a right back. Um, he is kind of slow. There are other better options available, but they're playing the freaking Premier League, and they're, it's really hard. That's why. That's one of the reasons why I want to get an icon here, and then I can put Kyle Walker here, um, or uh, Cancelo, or um, there's a couple other options. There's like three really good options, and he's definitely not one of them, but for now, he's got to work for me. If I do that, then that means Dembele's gone. But this is the team right now that I'm going with. Let me get Varane right out of here. Actually, search the transfer market. He was two. I'm, I'm looking at his price. He was two. What was he? Two, 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 two. Varane, 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 Varane. Where are you? I haven't written down where did I put you. Where did I put you? Where did I put you? There he is. Two twenty-two. And he is already going up. Look at this. Two fifty. He went up. He went up twenty k. And literally in two hours. All right, so that's my team right now. Um, a lot of question marks. I'm 138k, chilling. And what we're gonna do, which I probably shouldn't do, because I literally oh, that's what I want to show. How I got the little extra coins. Um, I pulled the light. I pulled the light. I pulled the light and Harry Kane in a pack, same pack, 7500 coin pack. So the odds are I'm probably not going to get anything from these 15k packs, so I probably shouldn't even open them. I probably shouldn't do any kind of opening pack opening. But Harry Kane, I sold him for 53, and Delay I sold him for 62. That's 100 and what, 10k? 114? I can't even, hold on, 62, 53, that's uh, 115k right there, one pack. And I also pulled Rodri, I sold him. To Bailey, I was buying him at like 60k and putting him up. Now he's at 68. Probably should have waited, but I was just trying to make quick coins. These were going for. I was buying these uh, position modifiers for about 25, 2600. So I'm for 32. Let's just show you guys real quick that sniping does work still. Yeah, I'm not sure if I really want to do these pack opening. I'll probably just put a couple points on, even though I really don't want to do that either. Oh, I guess you, I can't get points. Look at that. Well, that sucks. I really don't want to spend coins though. That's 75k I want to spend. That's 75k I can go for a couple other people. So I don't know if I really want to do a pack opening. I said I was going to. I was going to put points on but I can't fucking buy points. Unfortunately. That sucks. 
because I do want to pick up a, another um, De Gea and a Matuidi. Those are two players I do want to pick up because I think I can make double my coins back just by just by picking those two guys up alone. De Gea, I, I, if, I could, if I had enough for two more, I, I get two more. As I have 138. Matter of fact, maybe maybe I will buy. I will. I saw Casemiro. Yeah, I'm gonna get two two uh, De Gea's because I think he's gonna double in, in price. Let me go with Casemiro. Yeah, so I was gonna do a pack over. I'm not gonna do one now. <laughs> he was at like I think 30k. He's good. He is good. He's, his pace is just a little too slow. And I do like him a lot. I did pull him in a pack, so it's like it plays a place for my Real Madrid. But he's he is really slow on the ball. I just have him back. I play him. I play him like a third C, um, a third uh, center back, basically. All right, so he's not 30k, 27. He's not super, super popular. I like him, I love him, but he's still really good. Really, really, really good. All right, let me see this real quick. All right, 26,750. Did that sell? Yep, that sell. That sold. All right, so it's 26,500. 26, so I'm gonna sell him immediately. Wow, um, I thought I was going to quick sell it. Alright, so I'm going to look for De Gea. So we're going to change the video name. It's not a pack opening video. <laughs> I should just buy my Tweeties, because I think that's that's going to be like 20k, 20k, 20k. And then it, that's, I can buy five of them. So I can make 100k. Or buy two De Gea's and hope to make. Yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll buy my Tweeties instead. Uh, I don't. I just don't know. Five my Tweeties would actually probably get me more points. Thirty-three. I imagine uh, by tomorrow, will probably go. I'm not saying he's on a double in price. That's actually a, a, a big step. All right, we're gonna do De Gea again. I, I know that's gonna that's gonna skyrocket once they fix the freaking rebound shit. Nice. Right, so I'm gonna, I'm just basically getting the, a feel for what he's going for. Look, so he's already up to 78. Seventy-seven five hundred. Seventy-seven. Oh, let me just make sure. Now. Hold on. Is that selling? Yep, so 77 sold, 77,500. All right, so what we're gonna do is it's selling for 77,500. We're gonna try for 76. I just got for 70. I literally just got for 70 like an hour ago. Ah, uh, uh, one popped up right away, so I'm gonna go a little lower. 75.5. I really don't want to spend that actually because the price went up. Once it went up an hour that that much, that means people are buying them, but he could go back down. It's really hard to tell. Oh, come on, man. I thought I had that. You got to get it when it when it's just like put up and it says one hour. That's the, right now. I'm not getting that. Oh, I did get it. Okay. Same four five hundred. Okay, so we're gonna put him in transfer pile. Now I'm gonna buy, um... Dude, what is up with that? Put him in transfer list. Now I have to go up here just to freaking... I should be able to hit R2 right away. It's a waste of time. Alright, next card, I... It's either... REA is another one I can look at. Because he's an inform that's already out of pack, so this card could skyrocket tomorrow if the what's his face gets a freaking inform. And then it was selling for like 28. Oh god, that's not what I wanted. Ooh, 12. Great. Now I gotta fucking put the filter on because they put up they came up with these stupid fucking cards. 29k. 
Ugh, I gotta, I gotta do a minimum fucking bid. And I gotta set it for like 12 or something. Alright, so 28,500. I don't, I don't know. I, I have him, but I, I don't know what he will go up to. I think Matweedy would be a better, a better buy. Um, personally, it's really hard to say. But I, I'll probably get one of him and one of Matweedy's. All right, so twenty-nine thousand. I'm gonna try to snipe it for a little cheaper. Say twenty-eight two fifty. Only problem is, is that the minimum price is uh, twelve thousand two hundred fifty. So some people just throw up for whatever they want. I mean, it's a random price, at, I think 9K. I can't remember exactly what the random price is. But it's, which I have one. All right, I, mean, I just don't want, it, want any of those other cards to pop up. Christ. Was it, that, that means an auto buyer bought that. That's what that means. When it when it pauses like that, fucking auto buyers, man. I would love, absolutely love EA to get rid of auto buyers. Somehow be able to tell that auto buyers. There we go. Got one for twenty eight. Twenty-seven five fifty. See, twenty-eight is not where I want. I really don't want to buy for twenty-eight, but I know it's going to be at least thirty k tomorrow. Now I want to do another Matweedy. And he is. I got sixty k. How do I get sixty k? Oh, did what's the name sell? Oh, what, okay, Casimir is sold. I right, man, I'm gonna miss you, bro. I'm gonna miss you. I love you. I love you, man. I love you. All right, so I got Aurier, another Aurier, and De Gea. Those are the two buys that I had so far. They have 75. Aurier was 30. It's 90. That's 150k. Okay. Um. So Matweedy's an 85, so that's a safer, safer bet than 84s. Um, in regards to them being pulled, so I'm gonna try to get another Matweedy to sell. Let me make sure that's where I want to go with though, because I have top of the list players. Um, actually, Miltow was was, but he's. He's an 81 rated man. 24k, 28 would probably be his max. I'm not trying to make 3k. De Gea was number two on my list, even though he should be really number one. Matweedy number three. Rashford was number four, but I don't have 100k. He's gonna be over 100k. He's 89. Uh, Felipe, who's that? Felipe Anderson, 45. How much do I have? 60. You know what? I wanted to get actually. I did want to get OTW Lozano. As an OTW card, but it's hard to say how they're going to go down in price and go up in price. Uh, let's see, Hazard was 18k. The uh, his brother Brant was 47. OTW yeah, there was another one I wanted at 115. He gets an inform that's going to double easily. Uh, Nesta was okay 365 because I had him written down. Aubameyang, I kind of wanted him, but can't afford him. Zola, there was another one I wanted, 600k. Gattuso was 418, Gerard 470. But they're not icons, I wouldn't mess with them right now. Bale 184, he's he's one I really want to have everybody, but I gotta wait till I build up some coins, and plus I won't be able to match them up with anybody, really, because he's fucking from Wales. 
Navri 30 2750. I mean, that is a good car. It links up with Lewandowski. The only thing is, you got to play like Peace Check or whoever right, right back, unless you got enough for an icon. Um, hmm. Who should I go for? At what, 60k? I really want to get a, an invested in another another OTW car, and the designer already scoring for freaking Napoli. If he gets another one now, if he, I, I was comparing him with um, Felipe, and Felipe was like 100k, and they both are very very similar stats. I know Lozano plays in the Serie A, and Felipe plays in the Premier League, but very similar stats. And if Lozano gets an inform, just this is definitely, I mean, if he gets an inform, it's going to obviously double anyway. Most guys will double or close to it. But it could actually even triple. I mean, he could be like 150k. But I really don't know if I want to sit on 42,000 coins. That's a lot of coins. That's why I wrote down Hazard at 18. I can probably sit on that. But I want something that I want to, that I can flip tomorrow. So Lasagna, I cannot, I will not be able to flip tomorrow. There's absolutely no way. So we're not going to talk about him anymore. Miltow was a possibility. Matweedy, 36. I think he's going to go up to 60k. Simply because of, mainly because of Delaney. My, that's how I was comparing him to Delaney. I know Delaney's an inform. Probably shouldn't compare him to Delaney. But also he's French. And also have Conte and Pablo written down. But they're way, way too expensive. Over 300, 350k. Oh man, Nabry, should I go for Nabry instead? Should I go for Nabry instead? Or go for Matweedy, or go for both? I might go for both. Whoops, yeah, Mag, what? He was at what 32,000. Let me just see if I can find any here. Nope, he's probably going up because when I worked these down, nope, 32,000. Okay, 32,500. I'm gonna try for 31,750. I have him at 32,750, so a thousand cheaper, which and he should be rising. I really wanted to play a fucking game before I went to work, but it doesn't look like that's happening. There we go, there's one. Oh man, I fucked up. God, motherfuck. Nope, I'm not gonna get that one. That's, if it's already at 9, you're not getting it. Especially when. Maybe. That was close. Especially when there's auto buyers, man. It's really, really hard. I don't even know how many auto buyers are around. Probably like a fucking thousand at least. What people do to make make a quick buck just by playing a game. Unbelievable, man. Fucking auto buyers. It's crazy. I've seen the auto buyer in action. Like they're not they're not super fast. It's just what what makes it so fast is it refreshes quicker. Me, I'm going down too. I'm going as fast, pretty much as fast as I can. Now I have beat some auto buyers, but it's it's tough. See, he's probably he's probably going up as we speak, so none none are popping. Only that only those two. I may have to go 32k. What do I have him at? 32750. Yeah, I may have to go to 2k. Or 32250. Because he's already rate. Since I wrote this down three hours ago, he's already rose like probably 2k. So, which means your filter has to rise a couple thousand. It's funny, I woke up today and my, and my plan was to buy bail. <laughs> that was my plan. And save the, and leave the team the way it was. And I was like, nope, change my formation. Put two strikers up. Buy a cheap but pretty good striker. It's 18k. And then just basically just change up my team. A little bit. I mean, most of the guys are still the same. It's just I just added Thorum. Um, added Matweedy. Put Delaney on the bench. 
and just sold Casemiro. Let's see what. Let's see if I can find any. Yeah, he's he's going up right as he as we speak. Thirty four thousand seven hundred and fifty. I had him at thirty two thousand seven hundred fifty. So thirty four. Let me try thirty three two fifty. When you see nothing pop up for about a minute, you gotta you gotta raise it a little bit. That means the player is on the rise. Yep, that that's so too damn long. Anyway, I wasn't gonna get that if he popped up. And now people are I. Come on, that is the fucking auto buyer. I got that shit. All right, thirty-three thousand two hundred and fifty. So it went up. That's five hundred more coins I wanted to spend, but I ain't cramped for five hundred coins. Okay, and oh, and it's a fresh one too. The four star skill moves on this card links up with the new ninety rated player in the month, Lewandowski, very, very well. That's the only reason why people are getting this card. However, there's 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 no right backs. There's there's absolutely no right backs in the German league. The only right backs there are. Then look at this, thirty one thousand. I can't buy it. The only right backs there are in the, in the uh... oh my god, what the hell, lag, lag, lag city. There's no German one except for the only the piss check. Oh. I didn't want to do this. Jesus Christ, not 15 million. If it... <laughs> He's just drunk. Alright, 10k. Who, who's who's available? Kimmich? Kimmich is okay. Mabar, this guy is actually be be one that people would use. But I don't I don't like anything about this guy other than his height. 77 right and he's like 10 k for a 77 rated card. But Kimmich is like the only one. And don't get me wrong, Kimmich is a pretty good card, but I gotta have Pacey um right backs. He's really good at passing, and I, his shot should even be higher than that. He can actually score goals too. So that's pretty much that's your options right there. But people are content with Kimmich. Are they saying they're not? That's one reason why it kind of sucks, unless you're using, or you can go. Let me see the best German. Best German right back is most likely just Kimmich. So that's fine. People can, or, or you can go with an icon. It's like 300k. The next thing I was gonna do, I was gonna try to buy one, one more Matuidi's, and I don't have enough. I don't believe. And I, I should never. You should never spend all your coins. Never. But I'm trying, and he doesn't play right back. But I'm trying to. Um, this is this is like for me. It's it's a gamble. With gee, oh, come on, what is happening? These menus are like lagging today. Now, I definitely don't have enough for him, but I'm going to get one if I had to sell something. Alright, so 36,000, I need like 8k. I know exactly what I'm going to do to get that 8k. Alright, filter, we're going to go value very high to low, and we are going to sell one of these informs. I like Abraham though. Uh, we may not sell one of these informs. Oh, Jekko? Yeah, I think I can sell Jekko. I you know I had him. Let's see, 2k? I don't even care. Hopefully he sells rare. Oh, I got Ma Res too. So I can put Navri here. Yeah, there's my 20k right there. But Ma Res might actually go up, so I don't know if I really want to sell him right now. Mahrez is probably, his price is probably increased too. 25, 26, 23. All right, I'm gonna see what Mahrez goes for real fast. Did I sell that? Yep. I really didn't mean to sell him for that price.
think he's like 22, I want to say. He really didn't go up. He's one player that has not gone up. He's actually stayed the same. Actually, dropped a little bit. He was actually 22 yesterday. Alright, so 21. 21 selling. Yeah, so 21s are selling. Okay, cool. 21,250. Alright, 21,250 is not selling. Alright, so I'll, I'll do 21, even though I probably shouldn't. But I really want to get my tweet right now. Did I put him in here? No. Alright, so Mahrez is 21. Only reason why I'm doing this right now is so I can get um, a tweet. I wouldn't do. I wouldn't recommend putting him at 21 right away. All right, so we should have sold immediately. We did not sell immediately. Come on, man. Come on, man. Let me just go to a pack. La la la. Can I get people points yet? Nope. Come on now. How's he not selling right away? Oh, it was 21, right? Alright, there we go. He just sold. Took, took a little longer than I wanted it to. All right, so 49,000, I can get, um, let's see here, 49,300 and whatever. Probably going to be my Tweety. Probably, I'm just going over my options real quick, trying to see what can make the most by in one full day. Like, who's going to go up the most? I'll, I'll sell, I'll sell them, make some coins. It's either because Thursday you're going to have the rewards and everything's going to drop a little bit. So I'm going to sell everything on Wednesday. And, when, and then when Thursday comes, rebuy everything I just bought. And then Friday, sell them. It's simple, simple freaking money. Easy money. So I'm probably going to go with... I mean, Flippy Anderson's actually a nice card too. But it's also 84. No, I'm going to do my Tweety and then I'm going to Tweety. Because he's too, he's too underpriced. And, and to get a really good center defensive mid, or even CM, whatever you want to play him, you're spending double this. Pretty much anyone. You're spending at least 50k. You got guys like Goretzka, it's 50-something k. You got Witzel, it's over 50k. Which we is, is definitely, definitely under, underpriced compared to those guys. Alright, so I see him at 37. Don't want to buy him at 37, 36, 5. I forgot literally what I spent for him. Damn, everything's at 37. You know, you know who's doing this? It's like the freaking, um, this auto buyers. We'll have to go 36,500. And hope he, I, I can get one cheaper than that. And he was at 36. Okay, so he went up a, he went up a thousand in a couple hours. All right, we got 36.5. I probably shouldn't have got him for freaking 36,500, but oh well. Okay, next car since I have 12k left. So we got an extra Aria. We got an extra um, De Gea. Uh, we got Navri and uh, Matweedy. So those are four. But I'm probably going to use. Yeah, Matweedy, De Gea, Aurier, and um, Nabry. But Nabry's going to be on my team. He's going to replace Mares. I haven't played with him yet, so maybe maybe a good time to check him out. Alright, so this is my team right now. 
And unfortunately, I'll have to go to work in two hours, and there's not going to be a pack opening because I can't buy points. So disregard my um, my initial title message. Just, just ignore it. This is basically just uh, showing you guys my what I plan on doing and doing some a couple little bit of sniping and players to watch for this weekend. That's going to be on the rise, especially this weekend and maybe even next weekend when people get their coins. But it means everyone's going to rise. So I'm, this is really for those that have want to flip a quick flip within a day, and then um, make a few extra coins, and then on Thursday buy your team. Because I think Thursday, once once everyone gets the rewards, I think that price is going to drop a little bit. It's going to be only going to be for maybe like an hour, and then prices going to start going way up. They're going to drop because the people want to get coins for players that, that, that they're packing that they don't want to use so they're going to undercut everyone for that hour and then buy who, buy the players they want to buy and then after that is, everything's just, just going to go up but De Gea obviously I'm going to keep him I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to keep the other one until um, he goes up quite a bit because once they fix the goalies he's going to, he's the best goalie in the game and only at 70k which is crazy <laughs> Matuidi should go up to I think his max price is 70 75 okay so it's 75k 36 so he, he should at least at least go up 20k so this, this, this will give me a little little breathing rooms uh, to make a few extra thousand coins uh, before before Friday comes that way I can actually change up this team a little right now I want to play with this for now um, as like a placeholder until I possibly, possibly get rid of him. Up, I'm, I wanna up, I'm gonna sell him and him, possibly even him, and even even possibly Delaney and Navri probably sell everything and to get my first icon. I'm gonna, that's what that's what I'm planning on doing. That way, I mean not Delaney. I want to sell Delaney. I'll be able to put Delaney back here, most likely. To get my to get a center back, because I might sell Theo uh, Hernandez for as close to 80k, and then all the other players, players I just mentioned, so I can pick up possibly um, Yesta, Yesta. That's a Yesta Nesta for 365k, which is really cheap for a 90 rated freaking center back. Very cheap. I mean, range at 220. Yeah, he's got a little better pace and everything, but. Nessa's defense is so much better. And pace, to me, four, five, six point difference is not really that much of a difference. That's why I look at that. And I, it looks, I mean, I think Nessa could go up when people start investing in, um, or start buying the icons. Right now, it's just too early. So that's my current plan, but that can change in the next 24 hours. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, and until next time, guys, peace.